What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. So life has been pretty crazy lately. It's very. been non-stop. We've been super busy. Very, very, very busy, but productive, which is a good thing. Yeah, uh, it gets overwhelming at times, but we feel like we haven't been uploading as much as we used to on YouTube. So um, we asked you guys on Instagram to ask us any questions that you guys might want to know. You guys want to be, you know, updated on or kept in the loop. So I will go first. I don't have as many as she does. She has like almost twice as many followers <laughs> than me. So get my followers up. Go and follow us right now on Instagram right here. But yeah, you ready? Mm -hmm. Are we gonna be moving in 2024? 2024, <laughs> I would say our goal is to definitely buy a house. I guess we can tell you this now that it didn't happen, but we were actually supposed to close on a house earlier this year and for numerous reasons we just weren't able to but we just took it as like as a sign like it just wasn't our time yet and crazy to find out afterwards when we didn't close on the house janice wasn't even in love with the house <laughs> So I was like, why were you? Why were we going to buy it if you didn't love it? I was just like, I mean, if it's something that it's like a good price or whatever, like I, everyone says like your first home isn't going to be like the home you're obsessed with. So I was like, eh, whatever. But I went into it like, I was just like not feeling it, honestly. So everything happens for a reason. So hopefully yeah. the next time, well, the next time will be better. Yeah, we're definitely going to get a house, hopefully, fingers crossed in 2024. And hopefully this one that we, you know, one that we both love. Yes. <laughs> Guys, did your mom give birth yet? Oh my I gosh. Gave, I gave an update maybe like a couple of months ago <laughs> that yes, my mom already gave birth. My brother's one year birthday party is actually going to be in January. Yeah, two months. So yeah, that, that's that. <laughs> she gave birth almost a year ago, guys. <laughs> yeah. Have you sent out wedding invitations yet? Invitations, no. However, you guys, as well as other people know when the date is because we announced it, I believe on our, we actually announced it on YouTube, but we also um, announced it first, I think on TikTok. Mm -hmm. So yeah, um, invitations, not yet. However, the date is set. Yeah, we did send out save the dates. Yeah. Um, but that's not necessarily an invitation. So invitations are soon to follow. Are we gonna be doing Vlogmas this year? I'm not gonna lie, guys. I'm, I really do not wanna do Vlogmas this year. I don't, I really don't. How do you feel? Uh, I think Vlogmas has changed a lot since, I don't know how YouTube has changed. Since like five years ago. Yeah, so I think that Vlogmas at this point is just posting every single day. It doesn't really pertain 100% to Christmas. And we did Vlogmas last year. And honestly, I just feel like we're both in the same boat. We kind of aren't feeling Vlogmas. Until we have kids, it'll probably be different. Different, uh, it's gonna but, be a different ball game. That's, yeah, it's gonna be great right there. That type of stuff right there. But as of right now, no, we are not doing vlogmas this year. Yeah, no, sorry guys. We're gonna be doing Christmas content, so Definitely. you know, stay tuned for that. But we just don't want to do the whole 25 days straight. It gets very tiring. It's very overwhelming. It's not as easy as you guys think. Mm -hmm. This one is very ironic. It's been a while since we saw the Benz. Did you sell it? I will let you, <laughs> I will let you answer this. And you can go as detailed or not as you want. No, I did not sell the Benz. I still have. Oh, well. <laughs> that thing, it's ironic that this question was asked. All I'm going to say is if you guys, like I said, if you guys really want to know us and our real, real lives, go to our vlog channel. There will be an update with that type of stuff coming up really, really soon. Yeah, let's just say for right now, I didn't sell the Benz, but it's The Benz is not here though. Gone. Yeah, the Benz isn't here. It's not sold, but it's not here. And it's no longer mine. They're but probably like, what the hell do you mean by that? <laughs> it's not sold. I just don't have the Benz anymore. Go to the vlog channel. There's going to be a video dropping pretty, pretty soon about that. Like mm -hmm. really soon. So yeah. Do you guys plan on buying your home in Jersey or Florida? I am not <laughs> buying a home in New Jersey. If I'm not going to lie, if I was like rich, rich, yes, I would. I would have a home in Cali, Jersey, Florida, New York, but nah, I'm, I'm sticking to Florida. Yeah, I mean, hopefully down the line, we would be able to have two homes and that would be great. But right now, no, just Florida. No, we're sticking with Florida. The weather's nice. People are nicer too. Uh, when are we having a child? Hopefully... No promises. Hopefully after the wedding. Yes. And that's just keeping it real. So it could happen a month after, it could happen six months after. You will find out just like we will. It might even happen before. Maybe. All right. Maybe. <laughs> I did not expect that. I'm with that. <laughs> I'm excited for that one. Let's go. Isaiah, can we have a car channel, please? Mm. I think it's also ironic that someone says that because my, what did I tell you this morning with my car? Oh, I was gonna say, that's not really ironic because you're making it seem like you're gonna make a car channel. <sighs> So I'm in the works 
with my car right now. I'm not gonna say exactly what I'm trying to do. However, there's things going on with my car just like there's things going on with her car. Things so, are definitely changing. Yes, vlog channel. Go to our vlog channel. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you, you're gonna find the answers there. What is the future of the channel and what's coming? Mm -hmm. I like that, that's a good question. That's a really good question. That's a good question. Future of the channel, honestly, we're keeping it pretty chill here. Same old type of content. I feel like what we're really trying to get into is our vlog channel and really take that serious and build that up because I feel like there we're gonna be able to be ourselves um, and just be more transparent with you guys with like life events, things going on personally with us. I just feel like you guys will really get to know like the real us on that channel. So I know I've said it already, but seriously, vlog channel, <laughs> go subscribe. <laughs> Any collab videos soon? How do you feel about collab videos now? I just don't, Because uh, we used to question. do collabs. It's a hard question. I just want to just be 100% open and honest. I just feel like collabs back then were just to say that you've collabed with someone. And I feel like with us, that was never our intention with collabs. It was kind of just like we wanted to make friends. And then we, I don't know, realized that it's just more business than anything. <sighs> yeah, like... And it doesn't feel genuine. So I just feel like uh, us and I feel like a lot of our friends feel the same. Um, yeah. It's just like collabs just aren't a thing anymore. It's just not something like that we care for. Honestly, uh, Isaiah and I speaking for us, we just rather just make friends and uh, leave the content to us and that's it. My last question is what are some of your 2024 goals? Mm. Me personally, my 2024 goal, my ultimate one is to 100% buy a house. Cause I feel like we were super freaking close on getting it this year, but for numerous reasons, we just couldn't. Mm -hmm. And now it's like, I want it. Not so that I'm we couldn't, we just didn't. We, we could have made it happen. It just wouldn't have been to our liking. Yeah. Let's put it like that. But yeah, it's going to be minus to get a house. That is like my ultimate goal. Well, honestly, I'm kind of thinking about personal goal. My personal goal is to just really take uh, my fitness and health very seriously. And that's pretty much all that I'm like really trying to lock in with. Same, which is why you guys see me recently and like, you know, cut off t-shirts or whatever. We've been taking our fitness journey a little more serious. So yeah, yeah. your questions. All right, on to my questions. Let's see. Majority of my questions are pertaining to our wedding. Any theme ideas for your wedding? Um, We can't really say. There's not a specific theme because I know a lot of people do like winter theme or like, fall theme just know it's going to be we don't have a theme though do we yeah no it's really just what we like the colors and stuff that we chose yeah it's just know it's gonna be very beautiful no, <laughs> and that's all i'm saying no, i can't wait for our wedding it's gonna be so fun it is it's, it's gonna, gonna be, be so freaking lit. crazy i can't wait to get my ring too oh yeah i want it nice i want a nice one all right okay i went all out with yours go all out with mine well yeah i'm not wearing my ring right now because somebody's probably gonna comment about that i, I just realized just... that now i am offended babe you just cleaned all of our jewelry oh, you don't even right. have your earrings on oh shoot i feel naked <laughs> So Isaiah's. Uh, I don't even have my chain. Oh my god. Yeah, I don't have my chain on either. Isaiah just cleaned all of our jewelry, so it's drying right now. Whoops, sorry. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, bro, you just clean our stuff. Why are you offended? What do you guys want for the first baby, a boy or a girl? I know this is very cliche to say. Ultimately, team healthy baby. However, I would love a boy first. Um, I feel like every guy would say that, but for my reason, I would want a boy first because then if we do have a girl, he can protect his little sister. Yeah. I just feel like it's. I don't know, security wise it's better like that. Whatever happens, happens. Obviously you can't choose. I'm actually in the same boat. Like I feel like something, I feel like I'm just giving boy mom. Like I helped raise a lot of girls and I just feel like it'd be cool to experience like raising a boy. A lot of people we talk to, they think we're gonna have a boy as well. Just mm -hmm. like based off our like personalities, I guess. But yeah, we'll see. Yeah, we'll see. What made you pick Hazel to be your maid of honor? I love the choice, by the way. Love you both. We love you too. I've been getting a lot of questions about that. And I just feel like, to make a long story short, Hazel's been a very, very good friend to me from the beginning. I've had a lot of like tough relationships with friendships, not to get too personal, 
but i just feel like she's just such a genuine person she has such a good heart and i just i have so much love for her like her and milo are literally the most genuine people that we've ever met and they're just people who at this point have turned into family and i would literally do anything for them so that's why i chose hazel to be my maid of honor <laughs> oh my goodness guys all of you are like is the baby coming in 2024 like that's just all i see it might it might <laughs> he or she might he or she might someone said would you ever consider doing a makeup brand i'm not gonna lie i can't see you doing that nah i'm not i'm not like like if you would have asked like 2015 me i would have absolutely said yes but i'm not really into makeup anymore like i used to be you've got some stuff in the works like what you want to do obviously i'm not going to say yeah but she's she's working on stuff numerous things i am working on numerous things it's it's you just oh my gosh. do it already i <laughs> can't even share it because it's just so nerve-wracking to like just do it already just come out with it not, not like yet now. no not now i'm just saying like everything that you've been working on just start like you know um, show the world eventually eventually everything will come to light but I'm, i am working on things but it's not in the makeup world at all will you guys be filming the wedding and posting it on youtube of course bro we already got as far as like the wedding stuff everything's not everything a majority of the stuff is pretty much finalized like we already got our photographer we got our videographer we got our dj the venue event planner like it's literally the small little things that are left wait until the wedding guys i'm telling you it's gonna be so freaking fire i can't wait somebody said what contraceptives have you been using to prevent pregnancy <laughs> pull out <laughs> <laughs> nah, nah. Um, as you guys know, she has endometriosis. Mm -hmm. If you guys don't know, now you know. Um, but she takes a medication called Mifembri, mm -hmm. which is basically to control her endometriosis. And unfortunately, when you're on that medication, you cannot get pregnant. It is possible, but it's not going to be a good pregnancy at all. Yeah. Um, it could be a fatal pregnancy. So we kind of just like, just more mindful of that. Yeah, we really like take it. precautions. Yeah. yeah. Like I said, pull out. <laughs> what are the honeymoon plans uh, i don't want to say that no i don't want to say that we're going out of the country i will say that out of the country for sure but we're not going to say where we're going we will say though that we will say though that it, it has a volcano <laughs> We'll say that. And no, it's not Hawaii. Hawaii is Everybody's part of the country. Say Hawaii. Hawaii is part of the country. It's part of the 50 states. It's not Hawaii. Yeah, it's not it's, Hawaii. It's Even literally though. out of the country, like out there. And it has volcanoes. Yeah. So it's going to be a vibe. Give me one more solid one. Let's get one last good one in. Will you guys be having a big or small wedding? I feel like we answered this, didn't we? Not really. Big or small wedding. The guest list is going to be pretty small. Yeah. It's not going to be anything too crazy on the guest list. As far as the wedding itself, is it, is it going to be big? I, I don't want to say it's going to be big. I don't want to say it's going to be small though, but- I think I can it, describe it. I think it's just me personally. It's just going to be beautiful with like intimate people. Okay, so. And we getting lit. Yeah, I as far as the invitation list, like Isaiah said, it's not going to be a big invitation list, meaning uh, we're, we didn't decide, we decided no plus ones or anything like that because we feel as though the people that love us the most and the people that were there and supported our relationship 100% from the beginning deserve to be there. And I personally never liked the idea of having strangers at my party or at a big life event like that. I understand like plus ones are like, oh, like I, I wanna feel comfortable, but we made it a thing where everybody has somebody that yeah. they know that they won't be uncomfortable with, so. It's gonna be like, you know, my group of friends and then, you know, like her group of friends and my family, her family kind of thing. So, you know, everybody's pretty much gonna know each other. Yeah. So. And as far as like the venue, I'll just say this, it's not really a venue. I freaking, I, I love the place we picked. I just freaking love it so much. The view, everything, it's isolated, it's private. We're gonna have security there, so don't nobody try to pull up. Exactly. They're gonna be armed at that, armed security. Yeah. Um, <laughs> but yeah, it's gonna like, I just love everything about our wedding. That's why I, I can't wait for it. Like it was stressful in the beginning, like starting to plan it, but now that everything's like finalized and you can start to see the vision, it's gonna be freaking crazy. It's mm -hmm. gonna be amazing. And I still am getting questions of like, who's in your bridal party again? I said this on Instagram. I have not 
asked everyone i still have two more people that i have to ask um so and yeah that's all i have to say once i once i tell them and ask them then you guys will know yeah that was the last question so if you guys ever want to see like a part two of the q a make sure you guys let us know the amazon instagram comment down below any questions you guys might have we'll probably be doing these i don't know maybe like once a month or something like that but yeah with all that being said guys we hope you guys enjoyed today's video we hope it was informative we wanted to keep you guys updated in the loop but with all that being said we'll see you guys in the next video.